Hey students, let's study about feelings. The story time. Today you are going to watch a video about emotions, feelings. Let's watch. It's a great big world with a lot to know. Let's follow Beep Bing Bang Boop and Bo. We might go to outer space or ride in a truck. We might visit a bar near the chicken club club. Story Boots! Time. Won't you come along with us? Story Boots! Time. So much to know. Let's go, 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 go. Emotions! You don't need a light because your smile's so bright. You know you're happy, happy, happy. Like a birdie in the tree. When your laughter grows, you dance on twinkle toes. You know you're happy, happy, happy. And maybe your best friends are here. To give you good times, lots of cheer. Awesome things, the groovy beats, making stuff for yummy treats can make you happy. And you may want to run around, giggle, play, or be a clown when you're happy. When you feel good inside, all warm and satisfied, you know you're happy, happy, happy. And you can spread around all of the joy you found. When you are happy, 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 happiness can come in waves. Need of all the smiles you gave, things may not go your way, but everything is still okay when you're happy. And you will want to jump for joy, even share your favorite toys when you're happy. Hey, Bang, you feeling okay? You're looking a little blue. Well, at least bluer than normal. I'm just feeling a little sad, I guess. Maybe the kids can help. Yeah. What are some of the things that make you feel better when you're feeling sad? Like, make me laugh or something like that. Make them laugh? I can do that. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for trying, Bing, but I'm not really in the mood to laugh. What about we play a game? Playing games makes me feel great. Uh, I'm not really in the mood for a game. You water? <laughs> nah, didn't help. When somebody gives me a hug. Me too, my mommy. A hug? Well, that's a great idea. There, did that help? Yeah, I think so. Thanks a lot, Beep. You're a good friend. <sighs> I don't know why we're hugging, but I don't care. <laughs> when you are looking down and wearing a frown, shedding a tear or two, you know it's official when you start to sniffle, you're feeling sad and blue. When you can't be glad, something bad just up and happened to you. But don't despair, find someone who cares. A cuddle with Teddy will do. When you feel yucky inside and you want to hide, when these feelings stick to you. Tell someone why you have tears in your eyes and ask for a hug or two. It's not so bad to feel a little sad sometimes. What you gotta do? When you need to cry, let the teardrops fly. When you need to sneeze, go a choo! Have a little pout and let it on out. It's always the best thing to do. Just have a good cry and say goodbye to feeling sad and blue. Just have a good cry and say goodbye to feeling sad and blue. It's no fun being in a bad mood. Why are you feeling so grumpy? I was taking some honey and accidentally got my fur all honey like, and then a bee stung me right on the name. And I don't like it when I mess up, and I get really, really grumpy and I scratch trees. I'm so grumpy! So, how are you gonna get happy again? 
One way to make grumpiness to go away is for the coyotes, foxes, and bears to play with me. That makes me happy. Hey, bear, let's go play! Sometimes it's okay to be grumpy, but I would rather be happy, 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 happy. That's my echo. Happy, 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 happy. Well, you might be a little hungry. You might be a little sad. Or you could just be frustrated about the day you have had. Or maybe you're just tired, have a cold, or lost your sock. And you say, don't cheer me up. Oh, I sure don't want to talk. Because you are grumpy as a grizzly bear. It hasn't eaten all winter long. It has ladybugs in its hair. When you're growling, you know who. Well, it surely makes me want to climb a tree till your grumpiness is through. Ooh, when you're feeling like a grouchy, cranky crab that's in a hut, you might want to pinch somebody, shout and act like real tough stuff. Cause maybe you feel left out that you'd really like to play. Or something isn't fair and you never get your way. When you get grumpy as a grizzly bear, it hasn't eaten all winter long. It has jelly beans in its hair. But the best thing you can do is not to shout, but talk it out till your grumpiness is through. And a hug helps too. Some of the things you love. Ice cream. <laughs> Pizza. Uh, Pizza. Oh yeah. Uh, pancakes. I love the Santa hat. My bed and my sleep. <laughs> I like the chair. I love unicorns because some unicorns have the rainbows. I like skateboards. I love my cat Blue because. She's soft and she barely even smacks me. Uh, a duck. Mm, okay. Oh, I love all those things too. <laughs> Just like the bees love flowers, and flowers love sun showers. Love's the kind of thing that makes you feel all buzzy and warm inside, and it really is appealing when you have this loving feeling. So let it out and spread it far and wide. Because love's not just a word, but a feeling, have you heard? And you can use it to show how much you care. Love, it has no price, but it's extra special and nice. It's the best kind of gift you can share. We love the stuff that brings you joy Your friends, your pets, your favorite toys we Love your family and the thoughtful things they do for you You love to learn, to play and sing you Love the time to do your thing And don't forget to love the one called you Because love's not just a word But a feeling, have you heard? And you can use it to show how much you care Love, it has no price But it's extra special and nice it's the best kind of gift that gives you a special lift. So love the one you love and spread it everywhere. So guys, I was wondering if you could tell me what it is to be silly. Um. Uh, so my question about silly to kid bang to kid are you receiving me um bang i think instead of telling you what it's like to be silly they're showing you oh so being silly means doing something like this yeah that's it bang um you can stop making that face now bang actually i think this is kind of a good look for me Silly cause I wanna be Wiggly wiggly fancy free A bunch of monkeys are inside of me I jump all around and make no sense Have fun confusing my parents I roll on the ground and laugh a whole lot 
Stick on my tongue, move like a robot. When I'm silly, that's just me. Being goofy cause I wanna be. Give me zany, wacky too. Like purple ninja penguins at the zoo. I'll spin all around in my rocket shoes. Play dress up and bust dance moves. Make spaceman faces in the telescope lens. Be really silly with all my silly friends. When I'm silly, that's just me. Being silly cause I wanna be. So gang, that wraps up our series on emotions. I'm happy it went well. How does it make you guys feel? I love the parts when we talk with the kids. I'm sad that it's over. Well, I feel like there should have been more silly dancing. Huh? Uh? Boop. Let's work, students. Open our English book on the page 17. First, we are going to watch the video, the explanation, and then we are going to do this activity, okay? Hey, kids, boys. Today, we are going to study about feelings. Let's review some of them. We studied on the last class. Sad. Sad, Ooh, sleepy, sleepy, happy, happy, amazed, <gasps> amazed, amazed is something good, it's not scared, but it's something good. Now, students, repeat. Let's make a sentence, okay? He is amazed. Repeat. He is amazed. He is amazed. Great. She is sad. She is sad. The baby, the baby sleepy. The baby is sleepy. The baby is asleep. Great. She is happy. She is happy. Excellent, students. Today we are going to study new words about feelings, okay? Here. What does he feel? Is he happy? No. Is he sad? Maybe he is sad. But he is sick. He is sick. Maybe a fever. Talvez com febre. He is sick. This girl, students, what does she feel? Mm, she is. She is scared. Very good, students. She is scared. Repeat, students. She is. 
she is scared. What does he feel? What do you think? Is he happy? No. Is he sad? No. Is he angry? Maybe, but angry or mad? Mad. He is mad, mad. <gasps> What do you think? Is he happy? Yes, he is happy, but more happy. He is excited, he is excited. More, more, more happy, he is excited great students now i'm going to ask some questions for you you're going to say yes or no okay for example are you mad today are you mad today are you mad today yes Or no? I'm not mad. I'm me happy. Are you excited today, students? Are you excited today? Are you excited? Yes or no? Are you excited? Are you? Mm, are you sick? Are you sick? I hope no. Espero que não, students. Are you, are you sick? Yes or no? I hope no, students. Tell me. Mm, Are you scared? Are you scared? Maybe. Yes or no? Sometimes the teacher is scared. Especially about this situation. Especialmente que a situação nós estamos passando, né? De nós estarmos em casa. Às vezes a gente se sente um pouco scared. Alguns estudantes podem se sentir mad. Mad, porque não pode sair de casa, não pode ir para um clube, não pode visitar o amigo. Sometimes we feel mad. Or sometimes we feel excited, porque a gente não precisa ir para a escola, a gente pode fazer as nossas tarefas em casa. Né? Você? Excited. Or, I hope. E a gente está fazendo tudo isso para que vocês não fiquem sick, né? Nós estamos em casa, não passeando, não indo em shopping, né? Porque o shopping está fechado, não indo em lugares é, que a gente possa ter muitas pessoas, né? E nesses lugares a gente temos que evitar ao máximo para que a gente não fique sick. Ok? Let's review our new words today. Sick. Scare. Mad. Excited. Now, students, we are going to do one activity on the, on the page, English book, page 15. Ok? Page 15. Open your English book.
Unit Two, Student Book, Page Seventeen, Vocabulary. Excited. Mad. Scared. Sick. Unit Two, Student Book, Page Seventeen, Language. Are you okay? Yes, I am. I'm excited. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I'm mad. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I'm scared. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I'm sick. Now, students, let's work. Find and match. Okay, we are going to find these emotions, and then we are going to match. Okay, so excited. Who is in the picture? Excited. We are going to match, find and match. Is she? No. Is he? No. Is this boy? He is excited. Matt. Who is Matt? Mm. It's picture here. Excellent, students. Now, scared. Who is scared? Here. He is scared and sick. Who is sick? Here, this boy. Excited, mad, scared, sick. Great.
Until this is the end of our class today, let's review. Today we study about feelings and learn the vocabulary. Excited, mad, sick, and scared. Now let's sing our bye-bye song. I can clap my hands I can stamp my feet I can clap my hands I can stamp my feet Bye bye goodbye Bye 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 goodbye So students, thank you. See you next class. Bye-bye.